start recording again. Just for the fun of it, are you enjoying yourself, Melinda? Yes, I am. This is fun. See? Role playing games. Yeah. I mean, role playing games can be anything too. It can be um, running a church. You know, huh? the the role playing game. It can be running a bowling alley. The role playing game, or you know, <laughs> it could be anything. It could be and uh, you know, sci science fiction or anything anybody wants to come up with can be a role. All right, we ready for part two of this calamitous group of <laughs> missionaries. No. Ready to go. I think we're going to have to regroup. And <laughs> regroup, I regroup. I had a question. Yeah. Yes. Or is it directed to me? Oh, yes. <laughs> um. <clears throat> Do you want us only to use the dice in uh, the foundry? Yeah, okay. I do. So that, you know, people watching can see the dice rolls. Cool. And, you know. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, I don't know if I'm going to use foundry or not, but I'm doing it right now, but I don't know. I'll, you know. <clears throat> but so far, I'm going to use it, but I'll figure that out. I just want to make sure because I have dice, so I didn't know if that was. Yeah, be yeah, no, I, I, I kind of made that rule because I um, felt like people weren't really. <laughs> roll it roll you know telling me the real dice rolls on some of yeah, those no i get it um uh, i was like i, like, I like being able to see it i like being so. able to see it yeah, yeah visually yeah. i like it it's just fun to yeah and i really um uh -huh. uh, yeah it's just fun to have it that way um i do well, love I real it. dice I just though to ask it. yeah alex i do love real dice that's for sure yeah yeah because I, I i literally just got a set uh like a couple weeks ago that's really nice and so i was like i was hoping to break them in but <laughs> <laughs> nope not today nope. Nope. <laughs> one day with high production values we'll have like a, a dice cam everyone gets a yeah. dice cam and then oh. you know <laughs> <How fun. laughs> all right part two of this uh whatever we're gonna call this uh all right so um see that's your christian god running away you know that's you what he says. Saying? And so all the villagers see. Saying? Yeah. All right. Okay. Sorry. Go ahead. Okay. Do you hear what they're saying? Get behind here. Get over here. Get in these woods. Let, let's talk, guys. We got to figure this out. I have a question. What are we going to do? Okay. In my years of service, I have never actually used my weapon. <laughs> well, that clearly That's makes a sense. good. Well, I, clearly. I mean. Yes. Okay. You, uh, whoa, what were you whoa, doing? Whoa, 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 whoa. You were doing mm. strategic mission okay. planning. <laughs> That's what you call okay. it. That's okay. what you call I understand that. that was... Guarding. That was a... somebody needs to stand at the door. Mm -hmm. Uh, yeah, behind the woman. <laughs> she was a rather large woman sometimes. <laughs> okay, so that did uh. not go how we wanted it. I understand. Oh, you think? You think? <clears throat> I do think that. There are greater forces at work here. That leader up on the stage, I sensed some sort of, <sighs> not possession, but some sort of dark influence there. Oh, you so, must be pretty sensitive. You must be pretty sensitive, yeah. Yes, there was some, some dark things at work. So, I say, if we can... The, the problem is, is they believe that these horn things are more powerful than our God. So if we can show yeah. them that, you know, we can, I don't know, fight off the horn things, maybe then we can free the innocent children and then finally believe what we're trying to tell them. I, I don't know. If we're going <sighs> to fight the horn things, I'd rather go fight those two guys. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what uh, what <sighs> are these horn things? I mean, can we just like bait them out with food or something? I mean, God can Maybe. wisdom. We can what if... wisdom right here. Pray for wisdom. God does that. Hmm. Wisdom. Yes. I could also ask for a... Uh... If they're boars, you know, That's right. they're, they're boars. hungry. They're hungry. Maybe. Put the put a pile of food outside of their village and then they'll go eat at the food over there. I mean, if these guys bring have... their trash cans open or something... Like did, you, did you bring cattle? any food, um, Lady Miriam? I did for us, what but you know what? Anything? Would we be willing to sacrifice our food? I'm willing. I I would, but 
if we can perhaps bait them out and uh, I, I don't know Samuel do what you think about? that the three of us could take on these horned things okay okay here's the thing these 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 guys are about to sacrifice these innocent people i mean can we get them how are we going to get them to delay this we have to convince them somehow we have to present a plan so you see them taking them up they're they're (gasps) parading them them. um that way and and where are they going up the hill it's the hill's right there it's really a very you know the landscape is very um what do you call it steep <clears throat> and and there's a rise in, and it's very hilly and you guys are literally in the in the sort of a flat area uh, uh, in a narrow confines of this village you know so think of it like that there's oh, trees everywhere um you know a lot of sh- shadows and shade and they're taking them up this sort of forest path up this hill uh leading them and of course the guys making a speech over there and the people are all oh, you know they're doing their whole uh, emotional um, you know, as the sons are being led away, kind of a thing. wailing and weeping and gnashing. There you go. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Yeah, that's it. Perfect. Uh, uh, are these children, brother, brother uh, Alejandro? You mentioned children. Are these children? I can't quite. They're tell. they're oh, young they're men. Sons. Young, they're young men. Young men. Sons like fourteen, sixteen ish. Oh, okay. So and they're in, they're bound up and they're taking them. What what, what are we gonna do? What if we distract them uh-huh. while somebody comes and frees the guys? Yes. And right. Now you're using your brain. Thank you. Okay. No, that's, that's uh, we could go into the, the woods and uh, d- distract them somehow. Um... I do have a dagger. I could, like, it looked like they were just ropes. If there's a way we can get their... their guard guy away yeah, just maybe somewhere. Samuel could use my dagger is that possible Samuel I mean you're strong enough to do yeah. that right I, I can do it I can I can do it okay yeah you can do it all right can I uh, here I'm gonna I'm gonna share my dagger with you can I roll a okay. d4 and do that no yes, just let's do it well he, he has a sword I have a sword you have, have a sword, sword. I have a sword. <laughs> You've been holding out on it. Oh my goodness! I, think, I have two hands. Who needs a dagger? You do. Oh, you just you 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 do have one though, right? On your gear. Yes. Yeah. So, oh yeah, it's okay. right here. I've never had to use that thing, right? <laughs> <laughs> I thought you just had the spear. Okay. Fish, well, but... <laughs> Mister Sword Carrying Guard, that's even better. Okay, so uh, we have to figure out how we're going to follow them without them noticing we're following them, and who's how are we uh, going to get the guard away from them? We could, um, if we go through the woods and, and cut them off, uh, perhaps we could uh, t- try to preach at them again and, and draw them away while Samuel sneaks behind and, and cuts the rope. I, I don't know, it, something like that. Or mm. I can challenge them to a duel, which would <gasps> deflect the guards to me. You guys can maybe free them. Uh, but what uh, if these foreign brother- beasts... If they're so afraid of them, they have to be somewhere near. But they come out at night. We still have daylight. I, I, I'm not. I'm personally not. Well, let's see. Um, I, I feel like I, 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 I'm. I'm confident that uh, I'm not scared of them. Basically, at this point, when it, when it's sundown, maybe. But I'm. I'm good for now. Okay. You. You see. So, my brother. Oh. You see the 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 this the the tougher looking guard actually doesn't go. It's the single dude with the rope, the taking the boys up the hill. Yeah, there's only one. And just so you know, even though everything here looks close, imagine it all being kind of, you know, separated and far on the map. Mm -hmm. I'm just condensing it all. So it's easy enough to separate the, um, the, the, these boys from the village, as far as like the path they're going up and stuff. Brother Alejandro, can you handle a sword? I can try. Alejandro, sorry, a little nervous here, but <laughs> uh, I can okay. I can yes. try to handle a sword. I, I I can definitely cut the ropes. Okay, well between that I'm and not me very, and my dagger, I'm not very good at sneaking around, though. Well, 
Um, now it's a clearly, secrecy trait, by the way, sneaking around secrecy. Yeah, I don't have I'm negative one. Oh, I see. I am negative one as well. So, uh, Brother mm. Sam, how are you on secrecy? Uh, negative two. <laughs> Big guy like me kind of bump into things. Town guard. Okay. You know. <laughs> This is going great for us. Okay. Um, I, town guards tend to like to be seen. Secret, I'm sorry. Go ahead. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. You you don't have to be secret. You are. The way they approached, exposed. they were so aggressive. Well, I, well, I was just saying right I'm, I should probably sneak around. Anyway, let's go into the woods. And, yeah. and Well, aren't we in the woods now? This, this no. is where we're Well, we're outside the town. It, it, in the woods. Outside you're the town, outside right? the town that you're too embarrassed to go into again. Sorry, did I say that yeah, out loud? <laughs> All right, so you you follow the, the the them up the trail there. Okay, let's go. And I'm just gonna let you do that. Uh, it's 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 more spread out than this map, you know, shows. Yeah. Kind of thing, so that's not an issue. But yeah, you see them um, going up, and um, mm. what do Should you we ask? Do? You know, Should we ask. So they're they're going up a path, and it's 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 like an hour, okay, up along this forest oh, road. Oh man! You know, so the, and this is just a, uh, um, a quick little easy representation of that. So at any point, okay. you know, you can try to catch up to them and whatever you want to do. But uh, it, as so, we're walking, oh, excuse me. Um, as we're walking up, I would like to use with, I'll use one of my points for a prophecy. Which, okay. If I remember correctly, yeah. it's it's you roll a d20 and save that for something. No, well, you roll a d4. If, it, I mean, it depends on how many uh, points oh, you spend. Oh, okay. How many faith points you spend on it? Because you only have a few left now, or you only spent two, right? I've spent three. Three, and then how many have left? Uh, two. Two. Um, yeah. of the for the day faith points for the right? day. The regular so day. so if you want to spend those two, you'll get a d6, and you can roll it now, and you'll know the number. Uh, okay, yeah. And that number what you can if we use. all pray together? Can we all roll? Or no. add to his roll? No. No. Oh, um to add to his roll? What if we all pray? I mean, that's no. what they did. They prayed Well, and I'm not gonna stop God. you for praying. Shall we go into <laughs> battle? Oh uh, well th this uh this is just I will receive something that will help me later on. So that's what this uh, uh, prophecy you're doing. Prayer, prayer is for is prophecy. Awesome. Prophesizing, yeah. Yeah, um, prophesizing. I mean, you can still pray, Samuel. Preach on, preach man. <laughs> cool. Um, yeah, I'll go ahead and use my last two for the day. Okay. So and just roll a d6. Roll a d6, yeah. A five. Five, okay. So you can use that. You can use it on your, on you or you can give it to someone else. Great. Okay. Um, yeah. And I'll let you play with it whenever you want. I don't, you don't have to commit to anything. Make, yeah. Just make it easier on, on, on both of us. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, see, like, you know, he, if you give the five to Samuel one one time, see, I knew you were going to hit him, you know, or whatever. You know? Yeah. <laughs> it's like, like, that's the prophecy or whatever. All right. You guys are going up the, the windy path of this uh, yes. narrow, foresty path, you know, road, and there's lots of shadowy shade and tree you know the trees are tall and uh it's a lush green area and they're just i i, I will i will say um just kind of for some role play um i i i feel like the prophecy has, has told me god has done so many things he's he's taken five loaves and two fishes and and done so much so uh, i don't know maybe that that five number is going to be important anyway <laughs> interesting. very interesting okay I just I'm trying, I was trying like to tie it in some five <laughs> soldiers right now. Mm. Yeah. Uh, this seems like it might be quite the journey. Uh, this is quite the hike, and we've been traveling for quite a while to this town. Are, are you gentlemen hungry? I have some uh, dried beef jerky in my in my pack. If you'd like some, would you like some for sustenance? Oh, uh, yeah, I could jerky. use some sustenance. Yeah. Do you have any you water? Absolutely. Yes. Oh my gosh! Had... I'm sorry, I interrupted you. Go ahead, continue. Uh, yes, I have. I, I brought each of us a canister of water as well. Here you go. Oh, this is great water. Thank you. <laughs> oh, <for laughs> you guys are actually drinking. Okay, I forgot something for uh, um, Miriam. Let's do this real quick. It's not. It'll be quick. Um, down here, 
you actually get a woman's touch right here. You can pick one of these. It's kind of like a blessing. Uh, one of these little s skills Ooh. here. So. Uh, okay. Um, how about the mothering? There uh, you go. And that's exactly what you're doing. Yeah. 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 Rest, comfort, and recuperation. Yeah. All right. So add add mothering on your you know your Ability. abilities abilities area. Mm -hmm. Okay. And. I'm going to give you a D4 for that. So, so mothering D4, put that down. Yay. So okay. roll your D20 plus D4. And if you roll high enough, I'm going to, I, I'm going to give you guys some bonus. <laughs> and and it's not going to help. So the D4 yeah, okay. the six, four. uh, really just the worst. Okay. It's, it's, um, prosciutto dried jerky. So it's this paper thin stuff yes, you know ah <laughs> uh, yeah very sweet. keep chewing so. just keep chewing just keep chewing <laughs> chewy thank yeah, you thank you ah how long uh, a while it, it, a couple years it, yeah it, hmm uh, yeah <clears throat> but i know we have a long thank more way to journey i have more i bet i have better food to share later <laughs> well, if we need to, we can use this to draw out the um, horned ones, the yeah, horned that, things. I was thinking, thank you, Brother Alejandro. Yes. Um, so. I don't think they'll have any problem with them if they eat these things. <laughs> I mean, just saying. This is. This... Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh. Um, you see. He comes <gasps> down the path. Oh. <gasps> Okay, you! Sam, this is your chance. Okay, Cowards! Okay, 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 guys. He runs at you as you're wiping off the dried prosciutto off of your, your whiskers there, Samuel. Uh, uh, spear! <laughs> oh, you have a spear. That's right. Are you using two-handed or one-handed? Two hands. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so you don't even get your shield. You just give your spear. Okay. And actually, because you have a spear, you're going to go before him. So, well, yeah. Brother Oliver. You gotta grab his sword. You see him charging uh, at you with his uh, knife. Yeah, you oh, cats! Crap. And he's gonna uh, yeah. uh, hand me your dagger. Oh, here, here. Well, I, I'll use the dagger. You use the sword. Grab the sword up from the. You have okay. a cross. You have a crossbow, Miriam. Oh, well, that's not gonna help with the ropes. I'm going after the ropes. Aren't oh, I? you're going after the ropes. I'm sorry, I didn't oh, hear that. Oh, you're going after yeah, the. Oh, I thought. I thought the man's were... coming at me with a knife. <laughs> okay, Make I'm gonna. Your I'm gonna try to. I'm gonna try. <laughs> Try to grab the, the sword from Samuel's side. <laughs> oh, that! Oh, wow. Okay, roll your uh, aggression there, Alejandro. Let's see if you can get a twelve and, oh, and uh, definitely get that from his uh, side. Okay. Thank we have plus two to aggression. <laughs> see, you you got some physique, physicality. Ten. Nope. Ten. You're fumbling around. Thankfully, you didn't uh, <laughs> mess him up. Brother Alejandro, do I need to get it for you? Can you not get? Sorry, this? I tied it too tight. Sam Never used it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Samuel, the guy is leaping at you like a crazed barbarian uh, mongrel. Okay, we're just going to use my dagger for the rope. Let's go, Brother Alejandro. Did, did I grab the, the sword or no? No, and Miriam, you're trying to go around, basically, right? Can you see on the... I'm trying to get the prisoners to cut the rope. Yeah, okay, oh, so we'll, you'll, we'll have you do that, and then let me have Samuel now uh, jab your spear. Roll a d20. Plus your aggression, and I don't know if you got any other rolls, and you need to hit, his defense is a 13. It's a 12 plus his awareness of one, so he has a 13 defense. So you gotta roll it, beat a 13 with a d20 plus your aggression. To spear him. In Jesus name! Wow. <laughs> oh, I think, I think you want- Is that a nine or a six? I don't know if he wants you to be spearing six. anybody. Six plus, what's That's your six. aggression? With a five, it's 11. 11. And I'll use my prayer. You, oh, you haven't D4? used it. The D4? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, you only need two. Okay. Um, come on. Three out of four chance to, uh, to hit this guy. Parry him and disarm him. You did hey! it! <laughs> yes. right. All right. Uh, the damage is a D8. Uh, the D8. It's a spear. Two-handed. Ow, oh, my Ooh. goodness! Wow. Um, oh, he has more hit points than that, but nope. You... Uh, he runs right into your spear. I don't even know if you thrusted it as much as he ran into it. <laughs> he ran into it. 
But and you will say I thrust it. <laughs> and you're staring at the first person you've. I mean, this was a slaver, right? Or or a bad guy. You're just going through your mind, and you're seeing this evil face in front of you as it slowly drops. Dead. Oh. Dead. Uh. uh. <laughs> They shall not can mock I, our I... god. We shall be of, of courage and fear not. Mm-hmm. And in the meantime, I am. Can up... I? Um, oh, uh, hold on, go Samuel. Can take a D four extra, like courage, courageous, uh, like a bonus inspiration. A uh, hold, you know, like just like the prayer. Hold on to another D four. Okay. Yeah, Miriam. Okay. Okay. I'm. I... You're going and freeing him, huh? Guys, guys, <gasps> I'm here. I'm here to help you. The our our Lord has got, sent us to save you. But um, you're the ones that ran away we're... like cowards. What? I didn't hear you. Say that again. You're the ones that ran away like cowards. No, 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 no. See, that was the, that was the plan. We wanted oh. to look like we ran away so we could actually collaborate and come up with this way to follow you. We needed to see what was actually going to happen, see how it play out. So hold tight. I'm going to use my dagger here, here, to to cut this. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, just a little more, just a little more. I hear something happening down the hill with the. With my partner, <laughs> brother Samuel, and I know he's uh, got this. He's got a spear, and I know while, we're going to be while good. She's, we're be while good. she's cutting the rope, can I go over to the slaver and see if I can, like, heal him a little bit so he's not <laughs> dead? <laughs> I feel a little bad. Uh, he's dead. <laughs> he's skewered. He's dead, dead? Yeah. Okay, he's, he's done. Okay. He's evilly wake dead. Wake, wake up. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, I'll just rope, I'll just pray place. I'll pray over him and do like some <laughs> there you go all right all no guilt no guilt uh, uh you you've you've cleansed I yourself guilt Miriam roll your uh it's, and you've already succeeded but I want to roll how well you've succeeded so roll your okay. society roll on these okay. little these boys and persuading them of your courageous deeds how do I what do I roll oh sorry the d20 it's always a d20 and then oh, add okay. your society okay I see so. Man, you guys are rolling terrible. I know. Is that a nine or a six? In my my society's plus two. Yeah, the little dot tells you someone to roll for you in the future. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm not the only one rolling for here. Uh, yeah, this it's a the dot says see how the dots at the bottom there. That's the six. Oh, okay, okay. So I have a total of eight. So, okay, I, I can't quite wait. Get your through. society is plus two. Yeah. Really? Yeah. As a patron lady. Well, I, I I didn't have much time to figure it out. <laughs> <laughs> what did you put the plus three in the that you allocate? Put the plus three at spirit. I can switch those around. Oh, but then I have zero. No, well, yeah, because yeah, you're 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 more of a society person. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's okay. I'll let you do that because yeah. So yeah, pl- make that a plus five, and then your spirit can be a zero, or it can be a plus okay. two, or what, I don't yeah, know how you so roll. Six plus five would be eleven. Right, eleven. You still fail. Okay, no, but uh, no, you didn't fail at all. But just okay. you, you convinced them. They're convinced, but not old. You know, not. I was gonna do some overly stuff, um, but okay. that's okay. It's still positive. But they're like, oh, thank you, thank you. Yes, we, oh, whoa, whoa. And they kind of they're looking up the hill, like we need to keep our family safe and our village safe. So they're like, we should go. Okay. They're um, not going to, but they're that you know, you can lead them away. But they're like, we need to go, we should go. Be the sacrifice. Samuel, Alejandro, the boys are safe. Get up here. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna grab his sword before we do. Oh, okay. He has a dagger. Dagger. I'm you can write that down. Dagger. You want? Great. Um uh, Hello. Uh yeah, they're all timid, you know. Yeah, we farmer, we've, you know, boys, boys or whatever. Yeah, we have we've saved you from the the impending um, sacrifice, uh, and I understand that you 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 might think that the sacrifice is necessary, but it is it is not. What about the horned ones? What? Well, we have a plan. For that. Horned ones. We we will take care of our God. Will take care of the horned ones. There is no need to fear any longer. Well, what do we do? 
Do you have homes? Do Where you, are these old ones? Can, can we be, can we get you back to your homes and to your families? Do you are you here from this village? Are you from elsewhere? Yes, we're down in the village, and our families are there. But if we go back, then the horn ones will attack our village. No, no, they won't. No, they won't. You're free, and we will take. It. No, no, no. You are not the sacrifice. Okay. The sacrifice has already happened with Jesus Christ. You are not the sacrifice. So oh. let us go back. We, we will don't explain have the we truth. No, you, uh, you go back and tell tell the people that the the those who are from Christ have saved you and are saving the village. Yes, and you give and them God... this dagger to show that God has <laughs> delivered you. Yes, and 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 the, them oh. into our God's hands. Thank you. Yes, mm-hmm. we will go with you. Thank we you. We will go with you, and we will share that God has given us wisdom with a plan to take care of these foreign we... beasts. Yes, we should also find a way to figure out how to how to dispatch the horned beasts. Thank you. They they take off happily and they look back, you know. Should just make sure you take care of those horned beasts. I think we should move on and see if we can take care of the horned beasts. <laughs> the horned ones. Um the horned ones. Or either, yeah. Um so each of you take a D4, just feeling, you know, the Yay. the, the uh, or added, you know, have a D4 ready to dispense and if you combine oh, them okay. you can use them sing- in- singularly or you can combine it with your other one and, and it'll be a d6 you know if you want to do that okay so somebody's feeling foolhardy i mean courageous it's courage <laughs> all right you, you know guys- one of the things that turned my heart was Hearing God did not give us a spirit of fear, but of love, power, and a sound mind. Ooh. You have to understand that now. What a great revelation. Very glad you're starting to understand. I believe, I think further up the hill is the den of the horned ones. Okay. Uh, Okay. Den of Shoko. Yeah, let's go. All right. uh, which, uh, so we're just gonna go right up there <laughs> with the hair at because um I, 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 I um hmm, I was kind of thinking maybe we can make make a pile of food, not us be the food. Did you not see how I fend off the five guys that came at us? Five. It was one. <laughs> but... That was one. It seemed uh, like yes. five. <laughs> I think you're, a little, <laughs> you're a little delusional from the whole experience. The, so, so yeah, just one. And and it was a jerky. <laughs> oh, the jerky. I, 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 th- I think if we if we go up and investigate, maybe we can figure out something more. I uh, well, let's just see what what happens when we go up there. Okay. Okay. And if need be, we we yes, please lead. If need be, we run away again. I mean, regroup again. Right. Right. Regroup. Yes. Yes. Okay. Thank you for leading, Brother Sam. You. You. We are forever in your debt. <sighs> this is what I'm destined to do. Yes. All right, everyone, roll their aware roll. Now, if you want to add roll. anything to it, that's fine. But um, um, yeah, it's you. You know, walking through this narrow, foresty Italian countryside, and maybe one day we'll 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 do a business trip there to research. You know, the business you know business trip uh, thing, um, or work uh, work trip there to research the the terrain. But um, I I, oh. I have a problem. Good. I, that's what I live for, problems. <laughs> I, I, Which one I, am I rolling for awareness? A yeah. D20 plus your awareness. What are you going to say, Melinda? Okay. I accidentally clicked D4 twice, and so it has D4 on there along with my D20. Yeah, uh, just right-click, it. and it... Oh, right-click, and it'll... It, oh, you can't right-click, can you? It'll no. subtract them. Oh, yes, it is. Okay. Oh. The that's guard good. is actually doing his job for once, the town mm-hmm. guard. Awesome. Rabbit hole. Oh, four. So just disregard, disregard the one. Yeah. 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 Minus two. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Okay, so yeah, you you um, um, Miriam, you're um, you're busy looking through why they didn't like your prosciutto thinly sliced yeah. prosciutto jerky. You're just kind of looking through your stuff and wondering okay. if you're lack lacking anything there. Um, I'm yeah. Okay. Um, um, I got a total of eleven, so I'm not super aware. Alejandro, you're enjoying the the beautiful Italian country or you know hillside there in the forest and the peacefulness. And you're <laughs> are these trees so pretty? <laughs> Samuel, 
I hope I have some. You're butter. you're doing that Cylon Raider thing. <laughs> you guys smell that? <laughs> uh, you, I, all I smell is this jerky. Actually, that that's probably the proper thing. Smelling. You have you do smell something distinct, and that that is that has honed you in. You see in the shrubs up ahead, on both. Oh, actually, I need to roll something just to. Because you rolled, what's your total? 19 plus your awareness. What's that? Plus three. It's 21. 21. Okay, so I I do get to roll a counter roll to that. So let me see here. Bring it on. <laughs> oh, 20, 22. Can count. I'm smelling something very distinct. Smell it too. Six, six, okay. Six, you see over in the shrubbery, hiding rather low, are horns sticking out. And you know, you you see them. And there's two of them on each side one on each one on each side of the pathway and in, in hiding in the bushes and the shrubs. And they're definitely too low they're antlers sticking out. And they're definitely, you know, too low for deer. Deer would not, you know, be that low in, in that small of a shrub hiding under the trees. On both sides of the pathway, there. Look up above in the shrub. Oh, two what? horns, don't you see it? Oh, yes. Oh. Too short for a deer. Do, do they have jackalope? Yeah, there's here? one over here. Uh, let me. I don't think jackalope exists. <laughs> so one over here and one one further along over there. Okay. Hiding in the. There's one close by though. In... I mean, I certainly would have expected it to be much bigger to have a whole town up at arms. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But they must have some type of uh, fierceness about them for them. I mean, surely these people wouldn't just completely be so fearful. So, like, so if, since we know where they are, do you want to lay a, a perhaps a trap with some food and then we can uh, spring on them and, and have the upper hand? Or uh, do we just... Yeah. Yeah, uh, trap them. But what if there's more? What if what if there's more? And well, what, Lure them it, it out of the area? Can we drown them? Can we lure them to the? Can we? Can we? <laughs> oh, we should cast out the demons that's in that sorcerer and have the demons go into these creatures, and they, they, they can run into the water and drown, like in the Bible. Can you cast out demons? The oil. I can't. The oil. Yeah. I, can I can't cast out demons yet. Yet. <laughs> yet. Jesus said we could cast out demons, and that sorcerer down there—you know he's full of them—and that's enough to get these. I think I, I did not, I will say, I did not sense any sort of demonic possession. There was no possession there. He himself was using his own willpower to deceive the people. Oh, so I see. I, see. I, I, trust I, I don't think there's any sort of casting out going to happen. Uh, of course, you know, God changes hearts. But um, if we perhaps lure them out, and maybe we can see how many there are. And then Good we'll... Idea. Yes. Then what? So, um... Lure them out. Lure them out. Then they're vulnerable. With well, they're yes. Vulnerable. Samuel, with that roll, you do feel there's only those two in, in the vicinity. You're, you're pretty sure. Okay. With that roll, yeah. Yeah, there's only two. <laughs> <Wait>. <laughs> no, that's no, the jerk. No, no. Only two. <laughs> okay. okay. I say, let's bring out the some of our rations and just put them out there and... and, and, and then we'll see what happens. Okay, well, if we just put it out there, they're going to eat it and nothing accomplishes nothing. So why don't we attach it to a stick at the back of the cart of the donkey and, and leave the donkey out and then they follow it out to away from the village. Okay. Uh, well, you're, then what do we do? You're you're like an hour away from the village right now, just so you know. You're, you're quite a ways. Oh, right. We are. Because right. you're we don't want them going, going up the pathway. We're going in a different direction. We don't want them going back to the village. We need them going up over the hill. See, like, up, see that hill? Right, we right. Get them over the they're kind of slow, too. Yeah, the slope. Yeah. we got to get them on the other side of the slope so they'll go down. So if they follow the donkey, if the, if the food, our rations are attached to the stick on the back of the, the cart, the donkey this, gets over the crest. This is a little creatures. more complicated than we... Me. How about we, we just hunt them? We need a I say yes. Oh. I think we just I th we we dispatched of that 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 slaver very quickly. So I think we just go in and and 
sneak attack them. Maybe Wait, like, I don't them? know how that works. They're very bad gonna... at hiding. Are you saying we just kill them? Are you just want to like draw them out and kill them? Is that what you're saying? Yeah. I have a shield. They're they're, they're animals and small. they're they're terrorizing the town. So if we oh. can if we can if we can kill them and maybe I don't know bring back some evidence like their horns and say we this is what our god has done. Out. Oh. Or we can make armor out of it. I was thinking we we take it back and show them this is what our god has done and and you're safe now or something like that. I, Ingenious. I, I think, I, wow, okay, you are brilliant. I don't like that. <laughs> Where did that come uh, from? He, My nose is telling me something's up. Uh, Sammy, you look back and you realize that they, they appear to be gone from the spots that you were um, looking at them. Oh, you spent too much time you've lost, talking. We didn't you've lost do. now where they're at. Uh, roll, oh. Reroll your, Samuel, you may reroll your aware again. It's better be super high again. <laughs> oh, that's no. that's still pretty good. What's your total? 20. 20 total? All right. Yeah. You, you're the, 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 the hair on the back of your neck rises. Oh. The hair on the what? back of my neck is, right? is rising. <laughs> oh, what does that mean man. for you? Brother Samuel, what does that mean for you? What, what, what are you sensing? They're on the left. Yes, you see the shrubs shaking, and you now know they're charging. Um, here we oh. go. You see, coming out of the br- shrubs on the right next to you. Ah! Ah! And one, one comes yelling. yelling at... Ah! He's waving... This creature is waving these antlers in his hands, and he's got antlers on him, and he's this... Oh, so, because you see these frightful creatures, you all have to take a fear test now. And oh. now, 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 just, this is a game thing. You do get, because you're Christians and have the Holy Spirit, you do get a, a good uh, fear resistance against evil spirits and all that. Um, but when it's sort of just a normal fear, it's just a right, you, you have to just save regularly so there is a there is a difference like pe- non-believers don't get that advantage but that's only against supernatural stuff okay and this uh, is not supernatural it's just frightening to see a horn thing running out of the forest uh charging at you with you know crazed antlers and stuff okay so this fear is a trial rating or tr of 10 so you got to beat a 10 with your spirit roll okay so d20 plus your spirit Oh, that's not bad. Who rolls? Do we each oh, roll? Everybody, yeah. And if you fail, okay. you're going to have a penalty, and I'm going to bring this to you. Okay. Oh, nice. All right, y'all. Well, wow, everybody came through. Everyone, no one's afraid. Okay. Right. So Our good. So us. you see that it's a it's a furry deer mask. There's obviously a human underneath this furry thing. Um, they've got little bones sticking out like teeth. It's a, it's sort of an elaborate, uh, costume. crude costume, but yeah. they're carrying these crude weapons, which are antlers, uh, as they're they're swinging them around like crazy, and they look like dirty mongrel kids themselves or whatever. This ah! not kids; these are these are men, um, yeah, okay. you know, vicious men. So, because oh, you have a spear. I'm gonna so because you have a spear, you get. And I'm I'm assuming you're holding the shield now. Yes. Okay, so you get you, because you have a spear, you get the first attack. Oh, however, I take that back. But Miriam, if you use your crossbow, you get crossbow. the first attack. Okay. Do I have to roll or something? Yes, I'm going to let you do that. So as they're charging, you know, you... Okay, yes. All right. So you want to shoot the one coming up there? The one charging? Uh, the first one? I... You're going to let me do it? I don't understand. Yes. Do I roll a dice? Oh, yeah. Uh-huh. I'm just question? asking. You're going to shoot the close guy here? Yeah, Okay. of course. So roll... Your uh, D twenty plus your aware. That's your crossbow shot. Oh, I'm gonna, uh, I'm also giving you this, and this is a rule for uh, shooting crossbows. And I keep forgetting to, to mention this to others. You, there's a rule that you can do an aim. You know, like since you haven't moved, you're you're sitting there on your uh, wagon or whatever. You can uh-huh. you can focus and aim. So that gives so you can add a D four to your shot. Oh, wow! So I get two D fours. No, no one. No, no one D four. That the that D four is if you hit. The damage so don't do that oh, one I yet oh, so this okay, is okay. just to hit d4 plus your d20 plus okay. your awareness okay so oh that's a hit oh. for sure 
And then my awareness is three plus so three. 20. So you hit. All right. Yes. So now I get a D4 for aiming. D4 is for damage now. So roll your D4 for damage. Okay. Three. Okay. And it has. It? No. It has. I mean, no. But it, it has a little bit of a, a, a armor. Let me, and I'll explain when I roll. Okay. So four. It has a, a one to two, which I rolled a D4. But I'm, it's one or two is what I'm... So because of its fur, it absorbs two of your damage, so it only takes one. Oh, okay. But it stopped it? No, it didn't it stop it. Around? It just kind of... It's like, like think of a dart. You know, your your crossbow is very small, it's light, and your bolts are yeah. like large darts. So it, so it only does D4 damage. Um, so it just stuck in his armor, and it's just there. It, you know, it's, I'm sure it's bleeding him, but it's not, it's okay. not killing him. Um... Can I shoot the other guy? No, now that's your that was your turn. Oh. Okay, don't be don't be all uh, spoiled here and getting all the turns or whatever. <laughs> um, uh, Samuel, now, yeah, with your spear. Okay. And uh, same D twenty plus your aggression. You go. No! Oh, Natural Goodbye. twenty. Natural Goodbye. twenty or nat twenty. We scream nat twenty. So that's double damage. So it's two d six. Um, okay. Roll two d six, and you wound him. Means he's at minus d four for every roll he does. But it doesn't oh. matter. I'm pretty sure you, that that. Uh, I hate to use this word, but skewers him. I'm pretty sure. So that was oh. eight minus two takes six. Yeah, he's at zero, so he's down. Yeah. Way to go, Samuel. Um, he plops oh. down on again. Another, they people keep running into your spears. It apparently, um, <laughs> God has blessed this spear. The All Lord right. hath blessed thy spear. Yes. <laughs> now this guy runs up. Um, but uh, cleric, what do you do? Or, I will. Um, <laughs> I will. It's perfect uh, opening I'll, opener. I'll bless myself with a D four, and whack. Okay, and I'm gonna let my you staff. I'm gonna let, with your staff. Okay, I'm gonna let you do it because he's going for the um, for Samuel. Okay. Yeah. So bless okay. yourself. You get what D4 that we're doing. Yeah, oh, D4. And remember, this is combat faith points, so it's a yes. whole new set. Yeah. It's a whole new set. Yep. Um, so we're gonna roll that. Sixteen. That's. Uh, is that a hit? I think that is a hit. He's just a fast little. Fifteen is his defense. So. Yeah, okay. Fast great. little, with the so, horns and the. Uh, since I'm I'm swinging with both hands, I'll do my D6 for damage. And then... Three. Three. Okay, Got let me see if his... Oh, let me... I gotta reset his, his stamina. Is at seven? Oh, I shouldn't be telling you that. And you did three. Let me see his, if, his, if his bones and fur absorb one. So he takes two. All right, do a little slash yeah. on him. <laughs> You slice across his shoulder a gash as he swings furiously well, with his staff. So I think it's oh staff. Good. Sorry, that's right. Okay, uh, you just pop, bop him, and but he swings his antlers trying to you know stab at um, um, Samuel. All right, and then we're gonna roll an an attack on Samuel plus three aggression with his horns. I forgot to add three. Ten. Oh, Ooh. that's a miss because your defense is what Samuel. Just so just so I kind of know. Like a 17 or something? 15, I think. 15. 15, okay. That's a miss. He clink, clink, clink. You know, his horn just kind of clink, clink on, on, on you. Okay. And we are at Miriam's turn. Miriam. Okay. Uh, uh, oh, oh, okay. Great job. Nice trade, Alejandro. Um, uh, Let me describe the scene so you can and <laughs> figure out what to do. Now, the problem is, because of Samuel and the cleric, um, if you shoot at him, there's a, a little bit of a chance of you hitting your allies, your friends. I see, I see. Okay, okay. You can still try okay. to do it, or you can try yes. to, and you'll get an aim, so there's that, the, the plus D4. Or if you so, move around, I'll let... I also let... have a D4 bonus. Oh, I you still have that too? Yeah, I do. I haven't used it for the extra you gave us another one i used the first one but you gave us another one yeah yeah uh -huh. no you can use okay. that whenever you want okay i want to use it now this okay. is serious oh, okay 
Mississippi. So, <laughs> so I do a D20 and a D4. And you want to do the other D4? Yeah. And I'll do the, I'll let them be separate because they're a little different. Uh, so the aim okay. is... Yeah, there you go. Huh? Whoa! That's pretty good. 23. Yes! Yeah. So just so you all know, I, I generally combine die ranks, but it has to be the same stuff. Like, like inspiration is different from aim. So I'm not, I'll let you do the two different rules. Um, but um, yeah, that's a that's a definite hit. All right. So the damage is a D4. Roll a D4. Okay. All righty. Come on, damage. Two. All right. Yeah. Let me, yeah. It could. It might be able to absorb it. Let me see. It only absorbs one, so it takes one. So another, another dainty uh, bolt yeah. wow. sticks in its armor. Okay. All right. And now it's the uh, Samuel's turn with the spear. Okay. Um, I actually want to drop my spear and for the first time pull out my sword. Yes. Wow. It's about time. Okay. And as you do that silliness, he, he attacks you. But you'll still get your attack. But I mean, if you survive this. Um... <laughs> You know, because he's really fast and quick, actually. But this, the reason that you got to go first is because your spear. Yeah. Okay. And I'm going to... Ooh, 17! That's a hit, right? Yeah, because you're 15. That's a hit. Yeah, I got 15. Yeah, man. You, While you did that, uh, he snuck around. Um, well... Man. Pride cometh... Oh, he just he just scrapes you along your armor or whatever. It's not even... You don't, you don't even have to roll to, to avoid it. All right. Oh. Oh, yes. Thank you, Lord. Now it's uh, it's the... I'm going to go ahead and go with the cleric and then Samuel. So, Alejandro, with your staff? Um, Yeah. Actually, I'm going to... I'll bless Samuel. I'll use another one of my blesses okay. for today. Uh, so, that means, Samuel, you get a D4 for to hit. Awesome. And... And uh, d uh, just so you know, if you spend another, you could do another D4 for turns. That's true. Uh, but, or not. Whatever. You mean he can give his turn over to Actually, Samuel? I'll, I'll use yeah, I'll explain two. To you. Okay. I'll use two to give to add um, more people. Oh, so I'll okay. use two of my points. So uh, I'll give uh, myself and Samuel a D4. For one turn? For one turn. Okay. Yeah. So the way, yeah, there's three things you can do with faith points. You can mm -hmm. do the bonuses, like D4. You can do the duration, like D4. So up to you know, four turns, but you got to roll it to mm -hmm. see how many you get. Because yeah. you can still get one turn. And then you can do like a D4 for how many people get it, which is called Deluge. So he rolls it, and hopefully he'll get two, or you, or you can even get three um, mm -hmm. to, to the roll. So, and, and each of those is a faith point he has to spend on that. Okay, mm -hmm. And that's how we do the blessings here. They, you spend your faith points on those factors, and you can choose, you know, wh whichever ones you want to spend on. And okay, so roll your D4 so gonna... for... For deluge. Deluge. How many? So only one gets it. See, so I like. Uh, so I like how I do this because it it's still you can still flub you know uh, fluster and mess the, it up. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so then I'll give that to Samuel. Okay. So uh, he, gets he gets a gets D4, D4 for his blessing. For one, right. one round. Yeah. Okay. But you still. I don't mind. You can still strike too. I I kind of just let that yeah. roll together. So yeah. I'll go ahead and strike with my plus two. And Ten. I don't think that okay. hits. Yeah, and you're, you know, while you're striking, you're like, Samuel, you know, brother, carry forth. You know, like he yeah. gives you like that words of encouragement kind of thing during the, during the fight. So, Samuel, it is now your turn with your sword. And you get a D4 blessing to your strike. Okay. Okay. Oh, I forgot to change the music to something exciting. Oh, no, uh, roll a D20. Yeah, that's, that's the... Okay. Oh, I forgot to change it to. We, I need Ooh. a. I need a. Oh, I need a. You know, a, a, a DJ. I need a DJ for these shows. You know, like a, oh, yeah. a live DJ you know, mixer thing. All right, three. Yeah, that's not. Yeah, even with a blessing, I don't think you'll make it. Um, yeah. Okay. Um, whose turn is it now? Miriam's. Miriam's oh, Kate. Turn. Okay, he's bleeding. Um, so. Who's bleeding? I, oh, the bad I, guy. Yeah, we, we, we hit him with the staff and I nicked him with my arrow. Well, Two arrows. I, yeah, he's he's weak or one probably arrow. so if I can I arrow. um 
So what can I do? Guys, what do I do? Help me out. <laughs> uh, you could uh, use your dagger and run up and, uh, or you could shoot him with your, your, your thing. Yeah. I don't know what so else you can do. You can keep shooting him. I mean, okay. you're in a safe, yeah. you're actually in a safe spot. Well, yeah, I will shoot him again. There you go. And you, you get your aim too. Cause you, you're not, you're not moving. So you can oh. focus, you know, 14. All right. And then, well, you're, you, you've hit, so, um, you don't have to roll the D4 for the okay. aim. So that's a hit. So roll D4 for your little pokey damage, little okay. crossbow. Damage, damage. Three. Three. Okay, you're, you're definitely going to do some damage. Let me roll his little resistance. Uh, so that's a two for him. Uh, so he takes one. Oh, and let me roll his... After all of that, you guys are working him down. Oh, where's my chart? I have a little, uh, sort of like a morale. I call it the denouement chart. D oh. The de -doom denouement. So when, when, when a foe starts to take damage... They're gonna start questioning, you know, their resolve, and so I yes. call it the the denouement. And uh, since he's alone, and one of his the guys is down, and you guys are hurting him, um, he's gonna want to, yeah, he starts to, um, back off, and and he's definitely in the, okay, oh, you know, ow, 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 ah. Uh, is, does he look like he's yielding or is yes. he trying to run away? A little bit of both. Okay. Uh, I'll just call to him and say, stay where you are. Okay. I don't know. He stops. He's like, what are you? Who are you and why are you attacking the, the, the village? Good question. Good question. Um, Where are the slaves? You are not... What happened to the slaves? We are to get slaves. We have freed them and sent them back to their families where they belong. You will not have the likes of their blood on your horns. You, you are defying the ancient horned one. Our God is greater than any ancient horned one. You, you. Mm. Our God is here, and he's up there. And he points up to the hills, and you will never be able to stop the ho ancient horned one. Well, we just let the, pris the, the prisoners go, so I think we kind of won. So, sorry. No, you haven't. Let me roll his craziness here. And um, in, if you guys want to, like, roll your... Uh, Spirit or intimidation. Okay, he's okay. He's he's yeah. He's he's just, he's neutral. You you guys are gonna. You're foolish to defy the horn, the ancient horned one. What was that? <laughs> you're trying to <laughs> add your society to that. So you're trying to intimidate him, right? With your yes. like not charm. You're not trying to charm him. You're trying to um. It's a society. Over. What's that? Win him over. Okay. Yes. Win him over or. Okay, so basically, I, I don't know your mo here, but it seems <laughs> as though you might be a little hangry, and I have food, and maybe we could come up with a compromise. You don't. You're have not to you eat. when you're hungry. Yes, you're not you when you're hungry, and you don't have to eat children. You don't have to eat people. You can eat beef jerky, and I have plenty. So you maybe have... we could come up with a compromise. I, I'll take some food. Yes. Yes, and and then you actually. Once you are settled and you get your food, then you can, maybe we could have a, a, a nice talk and we could tell you about all the wonderful joy of serving the living God instead of this fake God that really doesn't do anything. So would you like to, would you like some food? I, I, I can bring it to you as you sit and rest as you're bleeding. Yes. Oh yeah, he's bleeding or not bleeding, but he's yeah. definitely wounded. Yeah. Uh, I'll go, then I'll, I'll go, if we're gonna, if we're gonna play it nice here, then I'll go ahead and heal him. I'll use. Give him the uh, I don't know if I can. I can use that outside of combat then. Um. Yeah, you're kind of done with combat, but I'll let you yeah. use one or you know one little healing thing. One little, thing. one little. Like a little a healing whittle. thing. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> a little healing. There you go. He heals one point. Fine. He looks at the. Still bleeding, but oh well. 
Well, um, <laughs> I brought um, some. I brought some gauze, and in my cart. Roll and your they, motherliness on him. Ah, yes. Okay. And you can use your society roll to that. Okay, so it's five, <laughs> five. plus two. Society's two. I mean, uh, five. She's not five, very five good at being five. a mother, but she's trying. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm trying. I, he's I, dirty. I, he's I, filthy. He yeah, smells yeah. just the way okay. Samuel noticed it. Um, you know. Yes. Okay. Um, well, here's your beef jerky and uh, <laughs> water and water. And oh, I know you're so thirsty and so thirsty. I know you get angry and if you drink up, drink up, you're going to be okay. And, um, Jesus loves you. So yes, we, and, and we love you and we didn't want to like hurt you, but I mean, you did attack us. I, I do. I'm very curious. The ancient horned one, do you serve him? Is he, you know, what, what, whoa, uh, what is he? He is up. He runs the mines. The ancient horned one gives us power, and you all will find. You all will encounter him <laughs> when you go and try to to stop him with your little Christian god. <laughs> and cut and scene. Oh, oh. man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very grateful for that. We gave him beef jerky. Oh, they're still hate. He's still angry. He's still angry. <laughs> He's still angry. <sighs> All right. So you guys have got to this horrible thing happening uh, up in the hills where they're taking slaves, obviously. Not even sacrifice, they're slaves. Um, Wait, and oh, by, I don't know if I've ever yeah. mentioned it, but uh, one important thing is there's old mines up there. You may have known that, or people mentioned it. Anyway, I might have forgotten to mention that, but there's mo old mines up there, so. Okay. Okay, so that's, um, uh, Melinda? Role-playing. That's our role-playing game right there. Awesome. You get how it works now? Yeah. Yeah. And I this is a Christian yeah. role-playing game, but doesn't it feel like a fantasy, but yet it has history and, yeah, you know. Yeah, it feels like it's fun. Yeah. It is fun. Exactly. All right. I hope it was fun for. Hope it's fun to watch too. We'll we'll see. I'll, that was a blast. Uh, yeah, I'll, and I'll give you guys links to watch it. Um, you know, unlisted because oh, uh, you can I would love show it to, to see people. It with the with the with the overlay and the map. Yeah, yeah. Okay. And um, but I'm um, yeah I'm gonna you know figure out you know for, for streaming thing and all that work it together. Okay, let me end it like as a show, and then I'll talk a little bit. All right. So all that right. was a while. You know, that was the ending of part one of the. Dubious three, <laughs> the, the trepidational three uh, trio. There we go, trepidational trio heading up, and uh, hopefully they'll be. What you know? Hopefully you will um, um, save. Um, what is it? What's the words? Ravio. 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 No, Ravio. I'm looking for vocabulary words here. Save, uh, liberate, liberate, oh. and save Ravio. Here we go. All right, the and. Again, Melinda, Alex, and Robert. Thank you all uh, for watching Holy Dice Rollers for the Lord role-playing game.